The Oprah Effect, What Authors Can Learn from Oprah. Hi, this is Dan Janelle from PR Leads. You know, there's no denying that Oprah can make a company successful overnight. The stories of her successful imprint radiate from the pages of Forbes, Business Week, and many others to attest to the king-making position that Oprah has played. Now that her show is going off the air, what are authors, marketers, and PR people to do? First of all, realize that Oprah was a lottery ticket. Like a lottery ticket, many people buy tickets, but only a handful win. The game isn't rigged, and the cards aren't stacked. Oprah picks what she likes, and we are all grateful that she has exceptionally good taste. For the people who didn't win the lottery, there's a lesson. It's okay to play the lottery once in a while, but don't put all your hopes and dreams in that one basket. You need to have several marketing tactics in place that you perform month after month, day after day. So while Oprah can point to hundreds of instant hits and bestsellers, there are millions of success stories that got there the old-fashioned way. They busted their butts by doing a few things right every day. Every day. The authors of the Chicken Soup for the Soul books talk about how they were rejected by more than 100 publishers before they found one who would print their book. Then they had to create demand for the book, which they did by doing five things every day. Every day. For a long time. Until the idea caught fire. <clears throat> While we all want to take the easy road, there's no denying that slow and steady wins the race. And those who do several marketing tactics consistently will always outperform the person who does nothing or who jumps from one bright, shiny marketing tactic to another. To create your own Oprah effect, I'd suggest you stick to the chicken soup effect. Do five things a day. Find the five things that work and never let up. I strongly suggest that publicity is one of those things. Go to prleadsplus.com to see what publicity tactics work best for you. And then give me a call, and I'll be happy to help you find the best solution. Thanks, and have a great day. Bye.